Well, as we mentioned, Fleet Week is here. It is your chance to see some big ships on the Willamette River. Yeah, four ships with the U.S. Navy and Coast Guard are expected to sail in from Astoria this afternoon. The first two ships did come in yesterday, and Cor Harlan joining us live right now aboard the USS Michael Mansour. Cor, uh, how's the water going this morning? How's the, how's the sailing going? Well, well, the sailing has been pretty much limited to being tied to the dock here in Astoria this morning, but they are just about to disembark here uh, as we've got a little tugboat action on the uh, side of the boat here, kind of getting us ready to get off of the uh, get off of the dock here at Astoria as the rain begins to fall, begin a, oh, a six to eight hour journey, I'm told, up the Columbia River to the west side seawall in downtown Portland. Here's the flight deck where we've been kind of hanging out all morning here. Uh, they've kind of uh, uh, chatted with us, a lot of folks here, uh, some, some military ranks. Some family, some civilians, some uh, cadets actually out here as well, kind of getting the day started aboard uh, the ship, uh, which is uh, which is underway now. Here's the eating area we're talking about, and a lot of this uh, this uh, part of this is as well as to uh, sort of sort of encourage and, and give kids, teenagers in particular. Uh, a taste of what it's like to be on a Navy ship with me right here is retired Captain Jim Christie. You're never retired though when you're in the <laughs> Navy, retired. really. U.S. Naval Sea Cadet Corps, and these are all the assembled right here, ages 10 to 17, you yes, tell sir. me, Captain, right? Tell right. me a little bit about uh, Naval Sea Cadet Corps. Well, thank you. The this Naval Sea Cadet Corps, we're patterned off of the U.S. Naval uh, Reserves. We, we drill twice a month, two, uh, and then we have annual trainings during the summer for about two, two weeks long. We have about 400 units across the nation, um, and we have our kids range in age from 10 years old up to 18 years old. Our mission is to develop leaders of character, and that's what these are here, right? And these kids, they get to wear the uniform, they learn about physical fitness, the Navy, the Coast Guard, the Air Force, and, and they go and they go to lots of training. They learn all kinds of leadership. And this trip here is just give them a taste of what it's like to be on a ship for a couple hours, Abs right? Absolutely. Yeah, this is great. We're, we're privileged to be on the USS Michael Munzer today, uh -huh. and they're going to have a great time. The, the ship's crew is going to show them around, and they're going to learn what it means to be in the Navy. We're going to get some tours. There. Thank you very much for being out here this morning. I, I knew I was going to talk to you the minute I saw you because you came up. And I love guys that talk. So. Well, we just we just love the sea cadets. We love the Navy, and we want you know we want to show show off our great cadets to uh, Portland and this great city here. So Good thank deal, you, sir. You bet. Thank you very much. All right, we're about to get off of the dock here in Astoria. Again, six eight hours later, we'll be up at the West Side Seawall. The crane has done its bit with the gang plank here. Uh, that is the USS Coronado over there that Carl is showing you on the other side of the crane. That will be up here as well. Boy, these are sleek looking ships. They look like actually buildings in downtown Portland or a little high rise buildings. They're, they're meant to uh, kind of evade uh, radar and sonar detection, radar detection really because of the way that they're designed and built. The composites that are in some of the shells of some of these uh, ships are just really advanced advanced stuff so we'll check in with you here in a little bit 840 I guess we're going to come back here we'll probably be out in the river by then and give you a little bit of an update here Carl's getting rained on right now I can tell you that and hopefully we'll be a little drier as we go inland for just a few hours anyway before the rain just kind of <laughs> does its thing all over the place hey it does its thing with the ships will sail regardless yes. thanks Cor. Thank we'll check you, back Cor. in with you soon